The United States might not be the most corrupt country in the world, but like every other country in the world, it does have its share of corrupt leaders. Speaking of corrupt leaders, some people may say that Donald Trump was the most corrupt president in U.S. history, while others would say that rank goes to Joe Biden or even Barack Obama. Well, in some ways, they may be right because each of these American presidents was corrupt. Take Donald Trump, for instance, who used his position to enrich himself and his family, filled his administration with former industry lobbyists, and sought to prevent an investigation into his shady business practices. That's corruption, right? However, regardless of whatever Trump, Biden, or Obama committed while in office, some past U.S. presidents would certainly give them a run for their money. So, who were the most corrupt presidents in U.S. history? Some of the answers won't surprise you at all, but others would be pretty shocking. So brace yourself as we show you 10 of the most corrupt U.S. presidents in history. 10. Ulysses S. Grant It can be argued that President Grant was probably not corrupt himself, but without a doubt his administration can be considered the most corrupt in the 19th century. President Grant was a war hero, and he should have retired as such instead of marrying his reputation by going on to become the president of the U.S., a position that even he acknowledged he was not fit for. During his tenure, a near ceaseless flow of money from speculation and Western expansion led to an epidemic of corruption. Instead of prosecuting those involved, Grant responded by stubbornly protecting those accused of graft. As we said, Grant's administration was the most corrupt in the 19th century and there is so much evidence to support this claim. One time, there was a massive conspiracy to steal tax revenue from whiskey sales, a conspiracy called the Whiskey Ring. This conspiracy snared more than 100 federal, state, and local officials, including Grant's longtime friend, General Orville Babcock. But these officials, including his friend, were defended by the president himself. Another time, the secretaries of the Navy of War and of the Treasury, all faced allegations of bribery and taking kickbacks. 9. Lyndon Johnson Some people remember this president fondly, owing to his role in Medicaid and his battle for civil rights, both of which were worthy causes. However, Johnson has a checkered history when it comes to ethics, with even his biographer saying that he rigged the election that gained him a seat in the U.S. Senate. The biographer revealed how he overcame a 20,000-vote disadvantage to win with only 47 votes. While in the Senate, Lyndon utilized his influence for personal gain rather than service to the country, obtaining consent to allow his wife to own television and radio stations. He then leveraged his influence to broaden their reach, resulting in increased revenues and profits. These decisions netted Johnson millions and ultimately made him a rich man. It is reported that Lyndon Johnson was so insanely corrupt that he stole 8 million troy ounces of gold in the 1960s from White Sands. Much of the gold was shipped to Mexico to be re-smelted and then shipped back to the LBJ ranch for storage. To top it off, Lyndon Johnson is allegedly responsible for the assassination of John F. Kennedy, who was about to drop the noose on Johnson for his corrupt activities. 8. Harry Truman you might be shocked to learn that Truman made the list of the most corrupt U.S. presidents in history. This is primarily due to his significant contributions to the nation, which include his defense of civil rights, his approval of the dropping of the atomic bombs to end the war and possibly save millions of lives, and his adoption of an internationalist foreign policy in place of the U.S.'s previous isolationist one. Still, his inclusion on this list is a result of his rise to the president. Tom Pendergast, a well-known and dishonest politician, supported Truman by using tactics that would be condemned in the modern era, such buying off officials. 7. Andrew Jackson The corrupt political system, also called the spoils system, whereby government officials were appointed based on what they had done for the incoming administration rather than on merit, was an ideology that dominated the 19th century and it began with none other than President Andrew Jackson. Jackson was the pioneer of rewarding support with positions in high places. He was unable to keep federal offices nonpartisan and rewarded lucrative jobs to donors, friends, business associates, newspaper editors who had written in support of Jackson, army veterans, 
and seemingly random characters. This decision by Jackson to reward his loyalists with some of the top positions which they were not qualified for resulted in inefficiencies and corruption. There was a myriad of thefts and corruption in distant offices and military posts, including $1.2 million embezzled from the New York City Customs House, the most lucrative point of entry in the U.S. It took decades to dismantle the spoil system that started under Jackson, and it can be argued that it's never gone away completely. 6. John F. Kennedy Aren't you shocked that we would dare to put America's most beloved president, both in life and in death, on the list of the most corrupt presidents in the U.S.? Well, even though John F. Kennedy may be America's favorite because of his charismatic attitude and aura of patriotism, the reality of his life is far from the picture that has been painted. As revealed by Seymour Hersh, JFK was a rich, reckless, and ruthless politician who committed many of the same ethical lapses and crimes as we see being committed today by President Trump. He was a selfish man who nearly caused nuclear war while not caring at all about his family or indulging in extramarital affairs, which could have jeopardized the country's secrets. JFK allegedly stole the 1960 election in cahoots with the Mafia. He initiated an invasion of Cuba and multiple assassination attempts on Fidel Castro, provoking Russia into the Cuban Missile Crisis, which was resolved through a secret back-channel deal with Russia's president. Kennedy initiated the unjust war in Vietnam and facilitated the assassination of President Diem of South Vietnam. He lied about and covered up a previous marriage and multiple affairs, paying women for their silence. It was his powerful friends and that of his father that protected him and covered up his lapses. 5. Bill Clinton Like his wife, Hillary Clinton, Bill Clinton more than deserves to be on this list of corrupt American presidents. Aside from the sexual affairs he had while in office, such as the infamous Monica Lewinsky scandal, he, along with Hillary, used the IRS to exact revenge on the people who had been against his administration with people such as Bill O'Reilly being audited several times during his presidency. The couple further engaged in vandalism and theft as they tried to transport White House property to their own home when they had to leave while damaging significant property as well. They also used the FBI to infringe on their opponent's rights by illegally obtaining their personal files. His foundation, the Clinton Foundation, has also been regarded as one of the most corrupt in the world. 4. George W. Bush George Bush's presidency has been regarded as perhaps the worst the United States has ever seen. The man was not only notorious for his excessive alcohol consumption, but also for recreational drugs. He was accused of sexual assault by multiple women, the most famous of which was a lawsuit filed by Margie Schodinger during Bush's term, and the circumstances surrounding her suicide a year later were still devoid of justice. Racism and sexism were also some things Bush was accused of. His government was one of the most corrupt, immoral, and scandalous in U.S. history. Aside from this, it is reported that Bush was only successful in winning the election because his brother purged nearly 60,000 people from the voter poll, who were incredibly likely to vote for Al Gore. Bush is also reputed for reaching evidence that showed Saudi Arabia's link to the 9-11 attacks, while there are widespread allegations that he attacked Iraq not to go against Saddam Hussein, but instead for oil. 3. Warren Harding Harding was a supporter of alcohol rights and a strong advocate for women's rights. He put in much effort for women's suffrage, which was enough cause for scandal in the 1920s. However, corruption and greed also plagued his presidency. But like Grant, Harding had no direct involvement in them. His reputation was tarnished by these corruption scandals in addition to his affairs, one of which led him to be blackmailed by a former mistress who threatened to expose their affair if Harding didn't vote against war with Germany. The biggest scandal that Warren was involved in was the Teaport Dome scandal. Secretary of the Interior Albert Fell accepted bribes to lease the Navy's oil reserves at Teapot Dome, Wyoming, to private companies. Aside from this, other cabinet members were arrested for various illegal activities, 
while he appointed people who were his friends in high positions. He even allowed Charles L. Forb, director of the Veterans Bureau, to leave the country, even after knowing about his corrupt schemes. 2. Ronald Reagan Corruption was the main issue that led to innumerable scandals during Reagan's presidency. 138 of his officials were investigated, indicted, or convicted. Each of them had their own massive but underreported scandals, but perhaps the greatest among all of the controversies that happened during Reagan's tenure was the Iran-Contra affair. With the Boland Amendment and arms embargo in place, the sale of arms to Iran and using that money to secretly fund Contra in South America while pocketing the rest was completely illegal. This happened right under Reagan's nose, yet he initially claimed to be unaware of the Iran-Contra affair, but he later admitted to it in front of everyone, thereby exposing just one of his many lies. Other scandals reaped during Reagan's administration include the CIA crack cocaine scandal, Reagan's support for apartheid in South Africa, the Sewergate scandal, the mental health controversy, the creation of Islamic terrorists, and more. 1. Richard Nixon President Richard Nixon carried the gold standard of presidential corruption. Nixon is the only president in United States history who had to resign because he was facing impeachment after the Watergate scandal which was so huge that any subsequent scandals that take place are given the suffix gate. The Watergate scandal saw many illegal activities conducted by Nixon and his administration, such as the bugging of the offices of opponents and people they deemed suspicious. Furthermore, recent news reports revealed that Nixon actually tried to damage the peace talks Lyndon Johnson held with South Vietnam, but the impact of his involvement is not reasonably certain. There you have it. 10 of the most corrupt U.S. presidents in history. What are your thoughts? Let us know in the comment section below. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and share this video.